What is up, everybody? Welcome to some Transport Fever 2. Hope y'all are doing good. So, I've been wanting to get back into Transport Fever 2 for a while, and I was trying to think of the best way to do it. Uh, I did streams on it before, and I've done a lot of content on it via streams, but I wanted to do some recordings, and I was trying to kind of figure out what I wanted to do. And instead of doing, like, everything recorded, I think we're going to do, like, um on and off so i'm gonna do like building railroad tracks like doing a lot of um busy work type stuff uh uh like in between i was gonna say offline but in between our uh episodes and then in the episodes we'll kind of go over what happened plan out some new stuff build like build stations kind of the big stuff so you're all here for the big content um without having to spend a lot of time wasting um, your time, my time trying to build stuff for y'all, and that way y'all get the good, y'all get the meat and a little fat without it just being overwhelming. So, we are, uh, doing things a little bit different. Normally I like a long map, but we're doing a, um, one by one, so it's a square map, which makes things a little more interesting in a good way. It, it really means we can, uh, have some fun, and, uh, I also upped the amount of water, which really didn't do much, just added a second river, and we have this little flat area my god this game is beautiful um so one thing i would love to do is i want to find a town i want to get a massive town that's one thing i've always wanted to do never done it so i want to focus on making sure one town is super built up and we are doing with th this with unlimited money um hopefully if i set up everything correctly and if not Honestly, I don't care. I just, we're doing this to kind of have fun. This is more of a creative as opposed to challenge. But I'm not going to be like instant, you know, high speed train from there to there. We're going to build up. It's kind of, it's more fun when you have to work and get things set up. So I'm trying to pick out a good town to start. 292 residents, 72. These are two big towns right here. 315. Okay. Not a lot. So it looks like. 227, 336. So we have a good little grouping of uh, um, cities right here. And I think Lee is going to be where we really uh, try and focus on initially. With it being in between these cities right here, we have a good population. Um, so let's start out small. We're going to go with the train first. Makes kind of sense. Uh, we'll do something kind of small, but easily upgraded. Now, I am using a lot, and I mean a lot of mods, as you can tell by this. Let's see, what are some of these, some of these things? Oh, yeah, just the end of the lines. Hmm. What are, okay, passenger stations. Uh, we don't want that. Something like this... Um, hmm. I, yeah, I think we'll go with this. Ooh, what is this one? Ooh, this is interesting. Okay, I kind of like that. I don't want to do that for now. Here's another one. Oh, this is... Okay, so this is one of the elevated ones. Okay. Okay. I did download a lot of really interesting, and this one, this one's pretty cool. I don't really see a very practical use for this unless you're having, like, something here and you're trying to merge lines from here and there. Um, I, that, please tell me I didn't just crash my game by doing that. I might have crashed my game by moving. Oh, no, we're good. Okay. They've made building a lot easier and a lot less... Uh, crazy but it's still not as good as it could be so let's do we'll do three tracks um we want a large building and we want 240 meters uh we'll do 280 now part of me would love to be able to just plop this down right here but we really can't i don't want to risk um, actually, here, first things first, let's go ahead and do this. And that gives us a little more room to work with. 
got my keybinds, and we want a cantery, and we want high speed track. Uh, one other thing we want is we want a terrace. Yes. Uh, actually, yeah, we'll do that. Okay, let's see. Okay, that should be pretty good. Okay, so I want to actually delete that road because that is not a pretty road. And let's get a nice little medium straight here. Okay, how's that look? That looks better. And we'll have it connect straight to there. And the other thing we want is I'm going to change that to tracks just to uh, save on some little lag that we'll probably end up getting. Um, I also got these. Um, I need to really figure out. These are toll roads. Um, so, yeah, th there's some cool little things we're going to try and do. Underground garage. Ooh, well, actually. Uh, we'll let's get a... I'm a passenger. I need to get some better passenger. Um, okay, this will kind of give us this will give us a good little starting area in terms of transportation. We want to turn this area into a mini hub. So the other thing I'd like to do is let's see if I can get this. Okay, we'll do that. And then we'll get a small street. Darn it. need to replace that um, nope and there we go road depot just bring it as far back as we can and now let's see we're just gonna build it like that and then um, We can, okay, so we can do some pretty stuff with that. I'll, I'll pretty that up in between episodes. Okay. So the other thing we need to do is we could just, well, here. Oh. Actually, we'll delete that. Have it come out. Kind of track over here. Go. Hopefully that's straight. I just like how roads go underground. Like that's way too deep. But we need it. So we want this to equal, kind of smooth out all of that terrain. Doesn't have to be crazy smooth, but just smooth enough. And the other thing we want is we want to, let's see. Yeah, perfect. Brush size. 
Let's just fill that area in. Nice little feeling. The other thing I would like to do is, there we go. I'd like to make this area just a little more tree-like. Okay. I know I said I wasn't gonna do a lot of this on camera, but we're probably gonna end up doing it at least at least in some of these episodes, especially since this is the initial one. We're gonna do a decent amount in uh the beginning parts. Okay. Now let's go to the right and we don't need a one way. We just need a small country road. Hopefully this, yeah, it'll just, it won't be a uh, stoplight, which is good. Um, I feel like that looks a little more, here, let's do this. And then, okay, that looks a little better. And we'll just do that. And that and that okay i think that's good um so we want to have a station here we're just going to we don't even want a big station here we want a small little station we want it one track of 160 meters and We'll have it go, let's see, where's it going to be coming from? We can actually have it, mm, we'll do 240 just to be safe. That one's going there. This one will actually have kind of do the exact same thing. I might come back and replace them, but um, I think they're good. So let's see, we're going high speed tracks. So we'll do 200 because I think that should be more than sufficient in terms of the speed that we, because I think at this point, the speed for these tracks, darn it, is going to be higher than the speed for um, the trains, like uh, the speed that they can hit. Train tools. Brush size, strength. I wish it was better. One thing I hate about this game is building tracks. You can't do it over a long distance effectively. Because um, then I'll do stuff like that. But you can, thankfully, they made this a lot better. The train tool is so much better. Makes this bearable. So we're going Okay. I don't know how I feel about it being a crossing. Kind of Can I Nope. Why would you do that? Why would you even think that's what I want? But I'm trying to see if I can get it. Oh, we can kind of get something. Let's see. Do we have a good... Not opposed to doing a little bridge here. Um, I want something that fits. I really wish it was... Honestly, I can I can get down with that. Let's 
see if we turn it. I want to make this as small as possible because we're going to have to do a turn. Okay, let's see if that will suffice. See, what, what path would it take? So to go direct to here, it will go... Let's see. Let's see if I touch it up, how it all look. Get a nice little touch up there, and then touch up here. Get, if we can raise the terrain in this area, give it a nice little. I'll actually come back through it, and what I'll do is I'll uh, here we'll just do this assets. Why, why? Like, obviously, y'all are. Okay, I think that kind of looks a little bit better here. Let's see how this looks. Oh wow, we have a actual level railroad crossing. It's not level for the road, but it's level for the track, which I'm fine with. I'd rather the road have a little dip in it than the uh, road tracks. I can live with that. Now trying to get, actually getting from there to, there's not gonna be that bad. So we're gonna cross, but unfortunately there's nothing, no better option for us than just straight up having to cross. We'll do that. Let's come here and touch up all this. We're gonna want a bridge. Now we're gonna wanna try and get a little bit of height out of this because we just, in case we do anything with uh, um, ships, which I'm probably not going to do anything with ships, but let's see. That might be the reason I can't get much height out of it. Let's go. Okay, so I'm, that should be as raised. I think that's as raised. Oh, wow. That is just full blown Golden Gate Bridge. Okay. That's good to know. I think that's a stock asset, too. Um, honestly, we'll, we'll stick with that. I can live with that. I like that. Very simplistic in, uh, its design. So, let's see. I'm not always a fan of using this feature, but sometimes it can be really helpful. Where is it wanting a bridge? See, I don't know how I feel about this bridge. Right here. Like, eh? If I could, like, let's see. If I raise this train a little bit, let's see what would happen here. And then try and even, okay. Now, let's drag this across there and raise it. Okay, so it did shorten it up. Honestly, I'm kind of okay with this. I can, uh, oh. I, I'm not feeling that part, actually. I'll take a little tunnel. Let's see. We'll give it a nice little, there we go. Kind of expensive, but hey, it's okay. And now we'll even this all out. Okay. And here we go. Touch that up a little bit. Touch up right here. Let me make the brush size. Okay. We can just do that actually. 
And we'll get this all taken care of. And then we'll just do this, and I think we'll call it. Now tell me in the comments, like, would y'all rather see, like, the full, you know, I, I can do long episodes, like, easy hour episodes, but, you know, I don't think that's, I don't know if that's really what y'all want. I mean, if it is, I'm, you know, let me know, please. Honestly, we're just gonna be a dead end. Well, um, we have that finished, and this one will do a uh, medium street. Here. Okay, so we have that. We'll put that there. We'll do that, and then we'll take that off. Okay. I like that. Well, thank you all for stopping by for today's little beginning episode of some Transport Fever 2. Got our first train line built. I think I'll um I'll get some buses set up, kind of pretty out a few things, and I'll, I'll catch you all back next one. So until next time, have a good one, and thank you for stopping by. Goodbye.